I'm looking around, I don't know what anyone else has for me around here. I might have to jump up and drag Floyd Mayweather out there and see what he's at again. Do you feel like you spoke this fight into existence, that you knew it was something you wanted and you made the rest of the world mm. want it as well? Mm -hmm. You know, Floyd has been in my crosshairs a long time. Floyd was very vocal about his disrespect to the sport of mixed martial arts. He wasn't necessarily speaking of me at that time. Then later on, I rose up and I became the face of the UFC, the multiple weight world champion. He started speaking my name. He spread rumors of the fight about to be made, and then that was it. All systems go, and we got the fight. As a mixed martial artist, you have this inherent timing and rhythm that, you know, traditional boxers, they don't grow up in the sport learning. Do you feel like that is a big advantage in the fact that you're coming in having this style he's never going to see yeah. on another boxer? Yeah, of course, uh, exactly. People fear the unknown, and that's that's what's happening here. You cannot, you cannot prepare for me. My unusual approach will shock the world. My spontaneity, my, my, my different attacks, my different angles, my distance control, my clinch. There were many aspects in the fight that will be studied after. It's okay to love me as much as I love me. It's okay. okay. Let it go. <laughs> He's known in the boxing world as probably the greatest defensive boxer of all time. Mm. What are you seeing in his game that makes you say, you know what, I can penetrate that? I think he has many flaws like we all do. So I think, again, the distance, the footwork, the unorthodox attacks, coupled with the precision and the power that I have, is enough to spark him inside two rounds. Inside too, all right. Probably. It's getting shorter and shorter. Yeah, yeah, no. Also, we're talking eight ounce gloves. I'm barely giving him a round, and that's. I'm, I'm trying to just give him two rounds, but I do feel one round he will be on, on, on the mat. For second round, he will be unconscious in eight ounce gloves. You have made a career off of shocking the world. How do you do it on August 26th? I believe I go out there unpredictable, confident, and put my shots on his chin and put him out. That's it. So many people have doubted me and written me off. We're not here to take part, we're here to take over. I'm young, I'm strong, I'm fast, I'm powerful. It's been very amusing to see that some people ridicule and completely disregard and disrespect my skill sets. He could have rolled off into the sunset. I'm not a sleepless film. I believe the world is almost going to explode on August 26th.